And he just needs to get on some way, somehow. And battle here in the bottom of the 11th. Alexander's wide and breaking ball. Yeah. Strike three. Like ball 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 ball. Alexander is pumped. And as he gets a strikeout, two here in the bottom of the 11th. And they're able to pull off the extra inning victory do the Owls. So the Gators drop their second straight extra inning game and fall to now 19 and 10 on the year with the victory. Florida Atlantic 16 and 12. Well, Steve, one of the questions you asked pregame was, is this a trap game? And you look at the records and you think, well, maybe this is, everything's going to be okay for Florida. They just beat technically won four games against teams in the top five of the country. And now you're facing a team that's 15 and 12 and throwing a guy that doesn't do all that much, but they uh, they held their own tonight. They did, and that's why baseball is the great game that it is. You think you're off to a 3 nothing lead and things look pretty good. You take advantage of some wildness by the starter, but you mentioned it during the broadcast, Chef, two or three times, too many fly balls tonight. I mean, that team strikes out 19 times, so basically they had six innings in which the Gators didn't have to do anything, and they still win the game, but they had 14 hits to go along with that. The Gators only had nine hits and really didn't have all that many offensive opportunities and scored just one run after the first inning. So credit FAU's pitching staff, too, for holding Florida down. Yeah, they did just enough. So now the, the key is you got to forget about this because you go right back to the uh, to the SEC. Kentucky is certainly a team that's going to want to beat you. They they're down a couple of games in the East. They're four and five, while the Gators are six and three. So uh, a tough task on Friday night when uh, they stroll into Lexington. Yeah, this one is one of those that you think you know we we should have had this at home, up three nothing, things going the right way, but they didn't finish the job and give Florida Atlantic credit. They win it 5-4. to four. Post game show begins after these messages on the Gator IMG Sports Network.